welcome back to my channel how is everybody doing today in today's video i'm going to be making some donuts but not any donuts the oreo donuts that's what i'm going to be doing today so i actually got this from my mom she picked it up for me at canadian tire it is actually a donut shop little kit thing um, i took everything out it's all here comes with pretty much everything I'm gonna need. So not sure how this is gonna turn out. It might be a huge disaster, who knows? Never made donuts before. Going on what the directions are telling me. <laughs> and I have everything already set up here. I have my oven on. I have, and of course I'll be trying one, obviously. <laughs> the chef has to try their meals, right? Here. <laughs> I'm kind of scared, I'm not gonna lie. So I'm assuming this is what I need to get. This must be the donut powder. I'm gonna cut the donut mix with some skizzlers. And I'm guessing you put it all in. But first, I gotta sniff it. It doesn't really smell that good. <laughs> Jesus, take the wheel. Combine it in the bowl is to take some water and it says to take one and third cup of water so I have my little measuring cup here would bind it all together so that's what I'm gonna do just like that Take my spoon and mix it together Good so far. <laughs> like, pretty cool. I'm just gonna whisk it a little bit because I do see some like dough bubbles. Eddie Crocker, it's a kitchen. <laughs> I do feel like Betty Crocker. I'm not gonna lie. A lot better since I started whisking it though. I got the mix all mixed up. Low dough and form in donut molds. So now I have to take this really cute donut mold. It's silicone, so I can reuse this. How much to put, but I guess I'll figure it out. Here they are, they're all ready to go. I did um, move them around to make sure that um, there was no air bubbles and to make sure that they were even before putting them into the oven because I feel like that's very important. A little messy right now, which is fine. That's the best thing about silicone, so. It says bake in mold at 357 Fahrenheit, which I do have, and only bake it for 12 minutes. So we're at, <laughs> Um, we're at the oven, and I'm gonna put these babies on up in the oven. Try to not burn myself, but you know, anything is possible. Here they go. Okay. 12 minutes it is. In like an hour or so, um, I took the donuts out of the oven, let them sit. Um, I took them out of the mold. Great mold, by the way. Loved it. Donuts in the fridge for them to cool down so I can decorate them and glaze them. So that's what I did. And here they are. There is four donuts, but they turned out awesome. Look how adorable these are. They smell so good. Now I'm going to glaze the donuts and decorate them. The glaze. So open it and pour it into here. Mm, smells good. There's the glazed where I'm gonna put the donuts in. I'm just gonna open the plastic bag 
got the cookies. Gonna open them. There's only two cookies in here. I'm gonna like break them up with my fingers. Because if it's too watery, it's not gonna stick to the donuts. A little bit more, not too much more. Okay, I think that will be good for the glazed part. Okay, I got the glazed. Oreo cookies. I got my glazed. And I think we're good to go. I don't know how I'm gonna do this. Maybe I'll just like take a donut and just like do this and then just rub it into the Oreo cookie and that should work. Oops. <laughs> 30 second rule. I'm going to see if this works. So I'm going to take a donut with icing sugar, rub it in there. Aww. Thank you. Let's add some Oreo cookie. So adorable. <laughs> Lift it. Here is the finished donut. Oh my goodness, they look so, so good. I feel like I may have made the icing a little bit too watery. They still look good. <laughs> and I'll let you guys know what I think. good it's different because it's not fried it's baked which donuts are usually fried not baked but so it's different but it's actually pretty good I'm not gonna lie very chewy not too sweet I feel it's like perfect that is me making Oreo donuts for the first time by myself I think they turned out pretty good and they're good too so it uh, looks like I'll be having a treat later guys that was my video I hope that you guys did enjoy this and I will definitely do more of these um, in the future if I see any more donut kits or anything I'll definitely get one and do them for you guys because I found this to be really fun um, it took a little bit but it was so worth it I got some awesome donuts in the end Guys, I hope that you enjoyed this video and I will let you guys go. Thanks for watching, guys. Bye, guys.